channel and today I'm going to be showing you what you would need if you were going on a family road trip. I'm sorry if you hear some noises in the background, just really sorry. So, um, the first thing you will need is a bag. I know you guys are like wondering, a bag? Why a bag? Well, a bag with some deodorant. So the reason why you will need deodorant because you're in a truck all day. And if you don't have AC, you're probably getting so hot right now. Your armpits are starting to stink up, girlfriend. And you just uh, need to put some on. You need to freshen up yourself sometimes, you know. So next, you have to go need some baby lips. And if you don't like baby lips, you can prefer any chopstick. The reason why I recommend chopstick, it's because that your lips sometimes get dry um, because trucks get cold a lot so you probably want some baby lips around or any type of chapstick like I said you can also get Revel or Eos the next thing you want is some Harrison Cranberries so yeah I really like that accent and you don't need this one you just need hand sanitizer you know, if you're on a rented bus or kind of RV or truck and you touch everything around, you need to you wash or hand sanitize your hands, okay? So that's that. Then next thing you want is some shoes to walk in. The reason why is because I wouldn't recommend flip-flops because um, you should actually have a pair I mean, if you like flip flops, you like flip flops. But when you wanna, when you go out, you kind of wanna wear some sh shoes. Like, so you wanna wear these, okay? But if you don't like sneakers, you don't have to wear them. The next thing you would want is, of course, a change of clothes. Um, for my pajama pants, I have these silk. And they add a little bit of them, and I like them a lot. They're really comfy to be in, and I really hate like if I'm in my shorts, I wanna just don't wanna be in my shorts. Um, I'm wearing my hat because it's really cold right now, and yeah. So let's move on to our next item. You'll want a blanket if you get cold because there will not be blankets for you when you go to an RV. I think I've never been in one, but yeah. So that's really basically what you need. You'll also need your toothbrush to brush your teeth, towels if you take a shower at truck stops or RV stops. Just some things that you like. I mean, you can also bring your electronics to listen to music or read a book, whatever type of person you are and what like what you like best for yourself. But bye.